Which I'll give out a 5 which to find distance on the uh, between two points on the coordinate plane. So the first way is um, uh, obviously using the distance formula. So if you have two points, um, let's say five, uh, negative five comma six, and uh, that's point A to to a uh, negative um, or to a uh, six comma six. So how can you find the distance use, uh, between these two points A and B using the distance formula? Well, so uh, this is um, x two minus x one squared plus y two minus y one squared. So this is x one. This is x two. This is the y coordinate of the first point, and this is the y coordinate of the second point. So we just plug in these values. So x2, 6 minus negative 5 squared plus 6 minus 6 squared. So this is 6 plus 5 squared plus um, 0. So this is 11 squared. So this is the square root of 121, which is equal to 11 units. Uh, the second way you can do it is just uh, draw the coordinate plane and uh, plot out these points and count the units. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, this right here would be negative 5, comma 6. And, uh, and 6, comma 6 would be 3, 4, 5, 6. Right here, so if you count uh, the distance between these 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, and then uh, another is six units. One, two, three, four, five, six. Five units plus six units equals eleven units in total. Um, uh, you could also use absolute value to find the distance. So, if the uh, two points are on separate coordinate planes instead of being on the same quadrant, I mean separate uh, quadrants instead of being in the same quadrant, then uh, you have to add the uh, two um, absolute values. So uh, this is this only works if you have the same y x y coordinate or the same x coordinate. So we do absolute value of negative five plus the uh, absolute value of Six, and uh, that's five plus six equals eleven units. So uh, so far it works uh, all of these ways. Um, uh, you could also uh, just do it mentally by um, if you have two points. Uh, let's do the same two points. Negative five. Um, the distance from negative five to zero is five units, and the distance from 6 to 0 is 6 units, so in total this is uh, 11 units, so you could also, also do this do it that way. And the fifth method is uh, only for um, for uh, two points that make a uh, like triangle. So if you have, um, if you have uh, three points, one here, um, uh, one here, so, okay, so uh, let's say, um, this is one, negative one comma zero, and this point right over here is three comma zero, and, um, 
So uh, this point right over here is is uh, uh, three comma positive five. So if we want to find the distance between, uh, let's say, uh, this point A, this is point B, and this is point C, if we want to wanted to find the distance between point A to uh, B, um, we could use the same thing, uh, 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 the distance formula, but we could check it another way using the midpoint formula. So uh, if you use the distance from distance formula right here, it uh, comes out to um, 3 minus negative 1 squared plus 5 minus 0 squared so that's uh, 3 minus minus 1 is 3 plus 1 so 3 plus 1 is 4 squared plus uh, 5 minus 0 is 5 squared so this is 16 plus 25 which is uh, 1 1 carry um, square root of 41 so, oh, uh, this has to be a perfect square root. Uh, I don't know if we change.